If you're getting gas and the scanner looks a little bit suspicious, you may be in danger of having your credit card information stolen, which happens more than you may think. Most recently, we did have an investigation that involved tens of thousands of dollars. Bozeman Police Captain Joe Swanson has seen many cases of stolen credit cards. Just over a week ago, a man was accused of using stolen credit cards at multiple stores downtown. The alleged thief spent over $50,000 on Rolex watches alone. How he got these stolen credit cards is still under investigation. This crime is not out of the ordinary. We do have a number of other cases that occur each week. Yeah. Captain Swanson tells me, although not every credit card theft leads to tens of thousands of dollars lost, smaller criminal transactions occur all the time. One of the main ways credit card information is stolen, tampered card readers at gas stations. Do you ever check for card skimmers on the credit card scanners here? I don't. You know, I don't, I should. I see all the news on it that you guys show on those things, but I, I wouldn't even know what to look for really to know if it's a fake one or not. They look so real from what you see on TV. There's security tags or tape that are over the keypads or the credit card readers. And if those look like they've been damaged or say the device looks loose, like there could be another device placed over on top of the credit card reader, those are all things that people should kind of key in on and say, that could be an issue. Another popular way card information is stolen? A lot of the ones that we do see is on the internet. Only use trusted websites, places that appear legitimate. Maybe you do a little bit of research if it's a new company. So what are some steps businesses can take to protect themselves from credit card fraud? Take a little bit of extra time. Look at the credit card, ensure that it, one, belongs to that individual. You can always ask for identification. And there's looking at the card just to ensure, okay, does it look like credit cards I've seen before? Captain Swanson suggests if you suspect fraudulent activity, to either call the bank the card belongs to or call a non-emergent police number. With summer coming up, there will be an influx of people in Bozeman, which gives more opportunity for credit card theft. The best advice we give anyone, frequently check your accounts, see if your card issuer offers free credit monitoring. Those are all things, just that proactiveness of looking and if anything does look suspicious, immediately reporting it. In Bozeman, Cassidy Powers, MTN News.